everybody, welcome to Six Flags Over Georgia Holidays in the Park. Now this attraction or event rather is included in your 2017 and your new 2018 season pass. It's also included in your one day ticket. So unlike some other parts that make you pay an additional fee, this is included. Great time of year to come, although the hours are reduced as it is the end of the season. It's a fantastic time to come if you are a fan of lights and holiday music. Hey everybody, Tom here from Beyond Walt Disney Planet. I am at Six Flags Over Georgia for the 2017 Holiday in the Park. It is all the holiday lights, holiday events. They have a train ride to the North Pole. So I'll be checking that out once it gets dark completely, which will be roughly about a half hour. I uh, will walk around the park, show you guys all the different lights that they have. Uh, a lot of the lights are already on, but it looks a lot better when it's completely dark. Any of the rides that I've been on, roller coasters, things like that, will be on a separate file under Six Flags Over Georgia, obviously. So if you'd like to see some of the roller coasters during my daytime at the park, check those out. So once it gets dark, we'll start walking around. Be right back. We're at the front of the park for the tree lighting. Investors here. Let's go. Yes. Let's see the light of another And all sorts of people around. Foghorn, leghorn in the back. Are we ready? Six, five, four, three, two, one. Light that tree. Got lights in all the buildings. All the buildings are all decked out in their lights. Even all the plant life. More lights on the trees. Now this is really cool. Lights all the way around. You change colors. Christmas music playing adds to the ambiance. Main station becomes a holiday train. All right, we are on the North Pole Express. Welcome to the North Pole Express. This is Mrs. Claus talking to you from the North Pole, where Santa and I are excitedly waiting for you to arrive. Santa created this magical train ride with thousands of twinkling lights in order to provide a glowing pathway to guide your way so that you can make it to the North Pole without getting lost. Throughout this journey, special needs and as Santa's wife and favorite storyteller, he is asking to tell you the story of life as we make our way to the North Pole. The lights will be our guide and the different colors you see not only will let us know that we're getting closer and closer to the North Pole, but the lights I have a special meaning that I will let you all know about too. We start with the color green which symbolizes nature and life. The evergreen tree keeps its green color throughout the winter, and along with green holly plants, is used as decoration during the holiday season, too. Evergreen plants like holly, ivy, and mistletoe have been used for thousands and thousands of years to decorate and brighten up buildings during the long, dark winter. Of course, the most common use of green at Christmas is Thank you. 
during the winter. In fact, in terms of fairing, those that remain green and even awesome with holly plants, with its red berries and the poinsettia with its brilliant red leaves, captivate a lot of attention. And now, the color brand is all around us. Red, of course, is the color of Santa's food. Christmas. See where they have this train station all decked out. All the white lights. Have my lights filter on again. Just gonna make our all the lights around look a lot brighter, a lot nicer. So you can see all the white lights all the way up on the trees. This is Monster Mansion. Lots of places around to get s'mores. You can make your own. S'mores kits are five dollars. You get two for eight, or you get a good deal of four for twelve. Get your graham crackers, your chocolate bar, a big giant marshmallow, and the sticks to put your marshmallows on. Everybody's roasting their marshmallows. All right, I made my way back around to the 
train station that I took near the front of the park. To continue on with the holiday lights. Got a nice nativity scene with the star. Anybody walking by kind of blocks it, but you know. More lights on the shrubs. Nice net lights. They got nice orange lights over here. Orange being my favorite color. Which might explain why Halloween is actually my favorite holiday. So I doubly love this tree. You have to get the lights all the way to the very top. That is awesome. I would love to do something like this in my house, but I don't own a crane. We are in the state of Georgia, so they have the Georgia peach below this tree. They do have various Christmas themed shows. Unfortunately, they do not allow filming of the actual show. I'm not sure because it's copyright with the songs they're using or whatever. Anyway, the show is right inside the Crystal Pistol. If you are here and you'd like to see this show, this is the place to go to. Assuming these are peaches that are on the, uh, the lights above. This tree has all yellow lights. Again, all the way up to the very top. Or yellow and white lights. See Santa Claus here. The Six Flags Holiday in the Park banner. The lights strung up in the trees. And by Daredevil, they got big tree. Or by DJ's 50s Diner. They got all the lights on little mini trees. And the snowmen. So I think it's a good spot to get a burger and some fries for a dinner. Gotham City has their own tree with the Batman symbol ornaments on it. The Gotham City Eatery has lights all around it. The lights and all the pillars. All the way down. We got the snow machines going. Right below the sign for Gotham City. A giant snowman near the top of DJ's diner. Various gift shops have holiday themed souvenirs you can get. They even have multiple places that are holiday themed restaurants. Mrs. Claus's Kitchen. Lights along the trees. This is the back section of the park. Railroad tracks go right along. You hear the train coming. The North Pole Express. All the lighted Christmas trees. Right by the carousel. Riverview Carousel. Traditional carousel with horses and carriages. All right, I'm looping around the other way to head back to the front of the park. All right, by DJ's Diner again. So this is a different path that I didn't take earlier. It's the last little bit of holiday lights. This other tunnel through was really cool, the way the lights are, and they all change color. And Retro Christmas USA.
love this song, Fats Domino. God, he had such a wonderful voice. Snowing 
up front as well. Courtesy of the snow machines, sadly it is not cold enough to actual snow. No, it does snow in Atlanta, Georgia. So as you might expect, a lot of the storefronts are decorated for the holidays. That's another nice window display. One of the Christmas elves. Another one over here making some toys. Another window with Santa himself. Well, lots of presents. It's a little hard to see this one because of the reflection of the lights. Six Flags Over Georgia, pretty obvious, but you know. So if you'd like to see any of the rides I was on, if you're a roller coaster nut like I am, you might enjoy seeing them. Uh, please like and subscribe, guys. As always, uh, I really appreciate everybody that watches. Leave a comment for me if you enjoy what you see. I got more places coming up that I'll be going to in the new year. So for me, to everybody, Happy Holidays, Merry Christmas, whatever holiday you enjoy, you any holiday you celebrate.